one thing for sure i know in this life uh, is good to be very very appreciative appreciate your helper no matter how hard it seems appreciate your helper even if your helper is uh younger than you appreciate your helper even if your helper is richer than you you have more money than your helper appreciate them of course you know helper they always get money passes but appreciate your helper no matter what don't look at the situation it's too awkward or maybe the guy they try now forget the matter appreciate your helper guys appreciate them the same way Israel is appreciating his helper. Well, I wish we all have helper like Davido, if we're better for majority of us. I say majority, I don't say all of us. We are some of us are okay by ourselves. So I don't say all of us, I say majority. Many Nigerians are not okay. According to the index, 80% of Nigerians are poor. So if to say we get helper, most of us, it will be better for most of us. But appreciate your helper. If you have a helper, I beg, hold that helper strong. Hold that helper strong. The same way Israel, they hold the video strong. So they, Israel posted something recently again. He said this is the first time he's going to France. Very first time. He said, first time being in Paris, France. Thanks, my God. All your children will prosper than you, sir. Amen. And to even think about it, eh, to think that his dread wife wanted to spoil the relationship between Israel and David. Israel wanted to spoil the relationship between Israel and David. So the question is: put yourself in Israel's shoe. Please answer this question. Put yourself in Israel's shoes. And you have a wife, be you a man or a woman, and you have a, a wife or a boyfriend, and your boyfriend is trying to remove you from your helper, or trying to make you and your helper quarrel, or your girlfriend trying to make, or your wife trying to make you and your helper quarrel. Will you pick your helper, or you will pick your wife? Or will you pick your husband, or you will pick? Your helper will you pick your wife or you're gonna pick your helper because Israel simply picked his helper Israel picked David do and say I beg oh, I don't get time for all those shit oh. quickly pick David do and let the girl go but sometimes sometimes Israel still come inside and talk about this girl though I don't know if he has fully allowed this girl to go and meanwhile of course you guys know Israel has won before Israel say no let your drunkenness carry you to the point say you go sleep with your wife oh thou <laughs> too more see the following wife so please be warned don't be too carried away to go and sleep with Israel's wife be warned be warned some tradition do not play Israel say said it that nobody should look at that woman and go and cross her because he has not they have not returned his bride price they have not done the traditional right to separate them so if you are a man you are risking your life you say tradition don't mean anything for lie eh? if something they are put to you for future may you know sin away till you pull your mind you pull your hand so come on hand for that is the wife in case you want to cross is the wife you let and tell and say oh Alpha, you don't do the tradition between you and Israel. Of course, it's very, very unfair to women. No? Men will go about knocking any girls they like. Meanwhile, their woman go there one side, the, the super. It, of course, it's against, it, it doesn't really favor uh, 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 women. But if you check, uh, men are the one pay bright price. Men are the ones seeking. So because of that, I think that is why they kind of like made the tradition that way. But be warned. Me, I know they do use tradition play. I be Muslim, but I do not use tradition to play. I don't go and look for trouble. You know, you don't go and look for trouble and say God will protect you. God never said, God never advised anybody to sleep with someone's wife or to even fornicate at all. God never advised anybody to do that. So 
may you get sense so that you won't use yourself. And meanwhile, let's talk about a whiskey. You know, the time whiskey were going around there spraying money, doing everything like uh, giving people cash and everything, going from one club to another in, uh, in Nigeria. Of course, most of you guys who are whiskey close, uh, whiskey good fans, and you understand how whiskey rule, some of you spoke out that whiskey was depressed. Some of you spoke out. I remember there were majorly, majorly tweets, headlines from persons for whiskey fans saying, whiskey doesn't hurt this way before. Whiskey is going through something. And that thing is losing its mother. Whiskey going around spending so much money on clubs and everything. This guy definitely did depressed. And as of today, Whiskey admitted that indeed he has been depressed for a very long time in a very, very bad area, according to him. But Whiskey is not currently in town, though. I think he's in the... Well, before then, guys, this is what he wrote. He said... He said, Mama left me. And I lost myself. Can't wait to feel myself again. Mama left me and I lost myself. Can't wait to feel myself again. Then he also said, And I'm thankful to you all going through this phase with me. You see me at my lowest now. When you see me back on my high, no complain, no. When you see him back at his high point, no complain. Well, losing a mom is one of those things that I will never, never wish on my, on my enemy. But unfortunately, everybody just have to die one day. That is just the way the world is. That is the gift, gift from God. That is the promise from, from, from nature. We still don't believe in God, but I believe in God. That is the promise from God. That everybody go by one day. So we want to see our loved ones forever, forever and forever and forever. Even you said you will buy one day. So it's something that is inevitable. You cannot stop it. It's going to happen. Certainly, certainly it's going to happen. So we just have to deal with it, go on, move on with his life, and they're all to the next phase. That's exactly what his mom will want him to do. Deal with it and move on to the next phase. And you know the Grammys is coming. Man, Whiskey not been nominated for the first ever Afrobeat award there. Eh? Africa, did. was that category again? Someone corrected me. Someone says no Afrobeat categories, Africa artists, Africa art category. Well, I'm going to check that out to really, really confirm. I wouldn't say it's a, it's a lie or not. I'm going to check it out, guys, to really confirm what category is for Africa at the Grammys Award. Well, on the 4th of February, I can't wait, man. I can't wait. I'm rooting. Of course, you guys already know who I'm rooting for. Oh, you guys know who I'm rooting for, but it what? what? Grammy, they are crazy. Really, really crazy. Grammy are crazy. They might give it to Arasta. Arasta said she has already prepared her speech. <laughs> She'd already prepared her speech for Grammy in case she, she wins. Well, yeah, let let her dream. Yeah, let her have that big dream. So she might be like, because when Arasta said she has already prepared a speech, so people were like, you, me, you just start music. Yeah, now you did prepare speech for speech for award. Who be you? Who be you? See, you guys, you guys will be surprised and eh? say it, it, it will be a female that will win that award. But if that female win that award, eh, the award will be sweet. Oh, I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg. Well, I, I'm not about to discriminate, you, but whoever wants to win the award, let you win. Grammy is something you cannot predict. Like, like you can only predict it if they are nominating some artists against each other. We predicted some American artists like Taylor Swift. Now you know that Taylor Swift will carry out. <laughs> so there is no expecting it. Something like that. So big up to Israel, at least. Israel is very, very appreciative. And also, crazy guys. We thought uh, 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 Jada and the whiskey are having some marital issues, you know, with the way whiskey was recently hanging out with Tiba Savi and doing all those crazy stuff. 
while in Nigeria. But no, they are they were at the red carpet together at uh, Bob Marley One Love. One Love uh, show. We are the red carpet together, and that's whiskey and that's Jada. That's good though. There were no, there were rumors like few months ago, as a last year now, beginning of last year, that whiskey and Jada are officially married. I don't know, but it seems that might be true. May that girl now ride or die, or, honestly, ride or die, ride or die. Whiskey, you know, the front end, but she's still there. Sometimes not about flaunting. If you carry flaunting for head, you will run. That girl is overly matured. That girl knows they carry flaunt flaunting for head. Man, I wish I figured that. Man, that can be now, now which baby you get now there's no go flaunt up. That is way too much, man. That girl is a keeper. There are some girls you're gonna date. If you do not flaunt them as a celebrity, you're on your own. Even though you give them everyone a heart, you do not flaunt them on social media, you are on your own. They will never believe you are in love with them until you flood them. Flood them and don't give them anything. They believe that you are in love with them. <laughs>